know if you guys can see that, but it says, Veterans Memorial Park, this park is dedicated to the men and women of the Tupper Lake area who served faithfully and honorably in the armed forces of the United States of America. And this is the monument to them and all the names of all the people. This town, Tupper Lake, is only 20 minutes from Long Lake. We have the same uh, type of memorial. Look at this. Sorry, we're on a busy street. But this is the same type of memorial that we have in, <clears throat> in Long Lake. This covers World War II, Desert Storm, Expeditionary Campaigns, World War II, Korea, Vietnam, Desert Storm. Sorry, I should be showing you this. Um, Vietnam, Vietnam Veterans, Vietnam Conflict. I mean, this is beautiful. This is just beautiful. We just ate breakfast at a very cute little diner. Homemade, beautiful, small country town. Same as Long Lake. There's my husband. <laughs> Today's a crisp day, but it's not too, too cold. Well, there's the town. We're right, this is downtown Tupper Lake. They even have a movie theater here. <laughs> we don't have a movie theater in Long Lake. Anytime we ever needed or wanted to go to a movie, we would, they would show them at the town hall. <laughs> but this is a, our big metropolis that we go to every year when we were young, school clothes, shopping and whatnot. But. I just thought that was a real beautiful sight to show you. I found this rock behind the, the uh, memorial statue, land of the free because of the brave. This is behind, oh, they have it here too. I didn't even see that. Wow. May their brave deeds and heroic self-sacrifices live in our memory forever. Wow, that's on the back side of this. Look at that. This is really nice. A very nice memorial. American flag painted on that one and over here on this side. A soldier painted on that one says, remember. We have left Long Lake and we entered this beautiful store in Blue Mountain Lake and it has everything, everything, everything. We're excited to be back on the road, but bittersweet. And look at this, is that not the cutest thing? <laughs> That's something else. And that's an actual, real, stuffed deer. Hello, buddy. Hello. And they got all this. Look at that. 
Look at this store. How do you do? How do you do? This is really neat. Really, really cool. Oh, this is nice. They have a little dining. I've lived, lived in Long Lake my whole life. And this is just a little store on the corner. In nine miles, keep left in, onto uh, State Route Blue Mountain 30. Lake. And I have never been in here. This is pretty cool. Those are all the coolers. Wow. They got everything. That's pretty cool. Yeah. I wonder how soft. Soft, soft. More things? Say hi, Tone. Oh. Say hi, Tone. Hi. <laughs> Having a rest. Ooh. Oh, we have the same same blankets and houses where I worked this summer. My goodness. All natural soaps, locally made. Neat. Mountain Maiden. Huh. Well, they're all done up for Christmas already. Oh my goodness. It's not even the end of October. Fishing stuff, candles, mittens. that you know that is that is true that you I lived in Long Lake my whole life and somebody will say how far is it to Alice Head Mountain and I'm I'm so embarrassed to say I don't know <laughs> I don't know because I never I mean I went as a kid all through school right. but I can't remember I mean, right. I'm getting up there yeah I'm filming I have a YouTube channel so oh. And this is the beautiful lady that owns the store. <laughs> oh no, I'm, I'm a, a lowly employee. <laughs> a lowly employee. Well, you still are a beautiful lady. <laughs> yeah, look at, oh my goodness, they got yum yums. Oh, uh, any junk food? Anyone want some junk food? Coffee. Tone, do you want a coffee? Uh, they got coffee. Yes, French vanilla, cappuccino, cappuccinos. Okay, coffee break. Sandwiches and burgers too. You do. She does. Sandwiches, coffee, breakfast, bakery sandwiches from the grilled salads. From the, oh my goodness. If you're ever in Blue Mountain Lake, guys, stop in here. It's a cool place. And they got, look at they got yum yums. Yum yums. Oh, Tony, look at that. Look at that one. Oh, yeah, yummy. Yeah. What's on your breakfast sandwich? What do you put on it? Uh... Well, it could be ham, bacon, or sausage, uh, egg, and then cheese, and a variety of breads. I mean, there's. Okay. Wow. Hi, everyone. We have left Fong Lake. I finished my last day on Saturday, packed up everything in the rig on Sunday, and we left this morning to come to Speculator for more work on the rig with Mike, and because his his name is copyright. I can't say where he is. It's where we were last year. About this time last year, look back in my videos and you'll find out where we are. 
And uh, let me turn you around. This is where we're parked. Off the beautiful main highway here is his new shop area. And Tony's having a bit of a lay down. Oh, he's awake. Look, 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 look. He's waving. <laughs> he's awake. He was laying down. And uh, so we are gonna be staying in this huge barn for the next four or five days. And he's got all kinds of work left to do on this property. And yeah, I'm right in front of this great big huge backhoe or whatever you call it. I'm no good with stuff, but he's got, he's got two of them here. And we are gonna get some electrical work done on the rig because we don't have, we've only got one driving light that works. And uh, there's a, all the buses are all lined up here. There's Ivan. I don't know who owns the white one. And no, wait, that's Ivan. Well, whose is that? I have no idea whose that one is. Oh, I, that's, yes, that's the guy that's helping uh, Mike. That's his rig, and it's gutted, and they're going to fix that one up. <laughs> There's Navi. And this belongs to Mike's sister, Rachel. She just bought this old gypsy wagon, and she's fixing it up. Can you believe this? This is such the coolest thing. And this is, this is original. Like this is a real gypsy wagon. It's so cool. Look at that. Isn't that neat? All the original woodwork and everything. Look at the wheels on this thing. So cool. So yeah, we are here. And then when we're done with the electrical, we've got a bit of a leak. Uh, I think it's our intake for the water. So he's gonna fix that. And uh, hopefully put a fan, cause the fan conked out. We have no heat and no air. Well, we have heat and air, but it doesn't blow. So hopefully we will get that fixed too.